How deep is the ocean? Deeper than the highest point on Earth's surface, by more than a mile. Just how deep does the ocean go? Blue whales usually hunt at depths of around 330 feet, within the well-lit zone of the ocean. Blue whales can dive to depths of more than 1,600 feet. Deeper down, at 700 feet, the USS Triton became the first submarine to circumnavigate the Earth in 1960. At 831 feet, we reached the deepest free dive in recorded history by the Austrian-born diver Herbert Nitsch. The pressure is 26 times greater here than at the surface, which would crush most human lungs. But blue whales manage it when they dive to a max depth of 1,640 feet to hunt giant squid. Nitsch reached the surface, recovered inside a hyperbaric chamber, and ultimately survived to tell the tale. At 2,400 feet, we reach the danger zone for modern nuclear attack submarines. Any deeper and the submarine's hull would implode. Reaching 2,722 feet down is where the tip of the world's tallest building, the Burj Khalifa, would reach. A little farther at 3,280 feet, we're deep enough that sunlight can't reach us. We've now entered the midnight zone. Many animals down here can't see, such as the eyeless shrimp at 7,500 feet which thrive near scalding hot underwater volcanoes. At this depth, temperatures are just a few degrees above freezing, but the water around hydrothermal vents can heat up to 800 degrees Fahrenheit. Around 9,816 feet is the deepest any mammal has been recorded swimming, the record was set by Cuvier's beaked whale. But not even Cuvier's beaked whales could explore the wreck of the Titanic, which rests at a staggering depth of 12,500 feet. The pressure is now 378 times greater than at the surface. Yet you can still find life like the fangtooth hagfish and dumbo octopus, the deepest living octopus on Earth. At 20,000 feet is the Hadal Zone, an area designated for the ocean's deepest trenches, such as the Mariana Trench. The Challenger Deep is the deepest point on Earth. If you tipped Mount Everest into the Mariana Trench, its summit would reach down to 29,029 feet, that still doesn't compare to the two deepest crewed missions in history. In 1960, the oceanographer Jacques Picard and Lieutenant Don Walsh descended to the lowest point on Earth, the Challenger Deep, at a record 25,979 feet below the surface. They held the record for decades until the explorer Victor Vescovo came along in 2019. Vescovo made three dives to the Challenger Deep that year and set a new record on the third dive, reaching a depth of 35,839 feet. Scientists have sent half a dozen unmanned submersibles to explore the Challenger Deep, including Kaika, which collected more than 350 species on the seafloor from 1995 to 2003. But scientists estimate there are potentially thousands of marine species we have yet to discover. Humans have explored an estimated 5% to 10% of Earth's oceans. We've only just begun to understand the deep, dark world that flows beneath us.